Okay, so here we are, night three of Tokyo. The last show here in Tokyo. And Keith, once again, is warming up, as always. That's how he rolls. Hey, Keith. Mm -hmm. Um, you see how you're holding your stick? You know, the way you grip your regal tip signature stick, I may add. But you know how you hold it? Yeah. Well, I don't know. It's just, it's not really working for me. I'm not really, I'm not really feeling it. I just feel like there's, you could do so much more with a, with a different grip. I just, I'm not, I'm not feeling that. Can I, can I show you a better way to hold your stick? Yes, of course. All right. I think this is going to really catapult you to another level. Sorry. Thanks. Um, all right. And it's not bad. It's, it's okay. I mean, I know you do this thing with your fingers and you hold it like this and and it's, you know, it's just so traditional, you know? It's just so traditional. Mm. And quite frank, honestly, Keith, like... Old school. It's been done before. That's the bottom line. It's, it's been done before. So, you know, instead of this old, tired way of holding the stick, I, I think that if you grip the stick from the top, like this, and directly hit this way, coming down at an angle like this, A, I think you'd get a much better sound from your snare. I just, you wait till you try this. You can really bounce off really well, and I just think you'll just get a much better sound. And then also, if you can manage to smash a hole through the drum head by the end of each song, I just think that would be another like added element of excitement to your drumming. And um, honestly, that would be like killing two birds with one stone, really. So it might be a little extra work for your drum tech, but I think it'd be worth it, totally worth it. If by the end of each song, you could also somehow smash a hole. I don't think that would be hard. But just, just try this. You really do get a much better sound from the snare. It looks pretty cool, too. It just feels really good. It feels really good for me. Hopefully, it'll feel good for you, too. But um, it bounces really well, and you can get a nice sound. So why don't you try it? Give it a shot. It's, I don't know, I, th I really do think it's going to take you up a couple notches. So why don't you try that out and let me know if I'm right. You'll notice that you get a really nice sound from the snare. Well, you might not be able to tell on the pad, but no, no, you grip it from the top. Oh, no, no, the stick is backwards, sweetie. Yeah. Now play with your right hand as well. This feels good, doesn't it? Feels really good, really, really good. I know. I told you. Don't you think it's just gonna? I don't know. I just think it's gonna be so cool. Let me I'll give see. It a shot. You'll give it a shot. Yeah. You really will. Do you think your drum tech will be mad about possibly smashing holes between each song? We have other snare drums. Okay. Cool.